Hello. Hello. Hi, good evening. Okay, let us check first. Can you hear me right now? Yes. Okay, can you see my screen as well? Yes. All right, very good. So, before we start, how are you tonight? Um, How are I'm you? here new. Okay, that's good to hear. I'm also fine. Okay, so thank you for asking. So, now let's start. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Okay, perfect. So, for tonight, we are going to discuss this one, which is all about formal and informal conversations. By the way, are you familiar with conversations, right? Mm -hmm. Do you know what is conversation? No. Okay, so when we say conversation, it's somewhat like um you are talking or the two or more persons talking with each other, just like what we did right now. So we have a conversations, okay? Understood? All right, perfect. So to further uh, discuss about formal and informal conversations, now I want you to read the definition first. Can you please read this one? Matching two friends use informal language. Why greeting people at work, they use formal language. All right. So when we say um, formal and informal conversations, chatting to friends, just like what I said a while ago, chatting to friends uses informal language, while greeting people at work may use formal language. Okay, so that is the difference between formal and informal conversations. Okay, understood? Okay. okay. All right, so I will repeat when we say informal language or informal conversation, that means, I mean, that means you're um, chatting with your friends, okay? Your classmates, your friends, your relatives, okay? While greeting people at work may use formal language, okay? So that is the difference. So now let's find out more. Let's have the formal conversation. So can you read an example of conversation for the formal? Good morning, Mrs. Miss Pescos. How are you? And then I'm this very, one. I'm very well, thank you. All right. So that is the formal conversation. Okay, base of this conversations or base of the words that they are using or that they are expressing with each other through conversation. So it's somewhat like it's formal. Okay, just like greeting first and then asking how are you? So that is the formal conversation. So if we are going to differentiate while the informal conversation, please read the example. Hi, Jane. How are you doing? Fine, thanks. All right. So that means informal conversations. Okay. So informal conversations, there is no somewhat like um greetings or yes, probably there are some greetings, but not, not the same with the formal. Okay. Just like, hi, Jane, how are you doing? And then the other one replied, fine, thanks. Okay. So this are the formal and informal conversations. So another example about formal, please read. May I introduce Emma Wilson? I'm very pleased to meet you. I'm, I'm delighted to meet you too. All right. So that is an example of formal conversation. Well, informal conversation, please read. This is Matar. Matar. Great to meet you. You too. All right, so that is the difference between formal and informal conversations, okay? Understood? Yes. All right, very good. So next, 
Let's have here fill in the gaps using the phrases in the panel. So the other one is already answered, which is good evening, Mr. Fisher. How are you? So we are not going to include the word how are you because it's already answered here. So now let's proceed for one to five. And then you're going to choose your answer here inside the box. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. Okay, yes. perfect. So number one, what is your answer for the number one? Great to meet you. Two. Okay, great to meet you too. Very good. How about number two? Mm, this this is test test. Okay, so let's try to check your answer. Good evening, Mr. Fisher. How are you? So that is the first answer. How about the second? Great to meet you too. Great to meet you too. So your answer is correct. Very good. So for the number two, let's check. This is Tess. Okay, this is Tess. Very good. How about number three? What is your answer? I'm delighted to meet you, Mrs. Malstosh. Malstosh. Okay, very good. So let's check your answer first. I'm delighted to meet you, Mrs. McIntosh. Okay, very good. How about number four? Hi, Cameron. How are you doing? Okay, hi, Cameron. How are you doing? How are you doing? Okay, so let's try to check your answer. Hi, Cameron. How are you doing? Okay, very good. Your answer is correct. How about number five? Yes, for number five. May, may I introduce you, Kandra? Okay, so let's check. May I introduce Dev Chandira? All right, very good. So you get the perfect score, which is one to five. Okay, very good. So we're done for this activity. Next, let's have another activity, which is 1.9. And then this is mark the best reply to each greeting. So now please read the instruction. Hi, Joe. Hi, Mandy. Good afternoon, Miss Sullivan. All right. So before we proceed that one, please read this one at the top here. All of these replies are correct. The sum are more appropriate for formal or informal situations. All right. So that is the instruction. Okay, wait for a while. Okay, so that is the instruction. So all of these replies are correct, but some are more appropriate for formal or informal situations. Okay, so now you're going to answer here for number one. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, wait for a while. Okay, can you see my screen right now? Can you see this? Can you see clearly my screen? Yes. Okay, very yes. good. All right. Okay, so now let's have number one. Good morning. Good evening, Miss Free. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Okay, so your answer is, good evening, Mr. Ray. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. So that's the answer. Very good. Okay, how about number two? May I introduce Ruth Pei? Um, I'm delighted to meet you, Miss Tate. All right, so let's check your answer first. Just to be sure, okay, 1.9. Hi, Joe. Hi, Mandy. 
All right. So that's the answer for the example. So the second or the first question, this is the answer. Good evening, Mr. Re. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you. Okay, so your answer earlier is correct. How about the number two? May I introduce Ruth Tate? I'm delighted to meet you, Ms. Tate. Okay, so you get the correct answer. How about number three? I'm delighted to meet you. I'm very pleased to meet you too. Okay, this is Vicky. I'm very pleased to meet you too. So that is your answer. Let's check first. All right. Okay, wait for a while. So this is 1.9. Okay. I'm delighted for number four. This is Vicky. Great to meet you. Okay, the answer is? Great to meet you. Okay, so this is Vicky. Great to meet you. How about number five? Hey, lovely to see you. Uh, Pete, Pete, Peter, great to see you too. Okay, Pete, great to see you too. So let's track your answer. Kaya, lovely to see you. Pete, great to see you too. All right, so you get the correct score. I mean, correct answer. Very good. So let's have now for another activity, which is 1.10. And then this is respond to the audio, speaking out loud. Okay, this side. So you're going to listen to the audio. Okay, then later on, you're going to answer this one. Okay, but before that one, I will let you answer this one first, okay? So here, may I introduce Mr. Tom Grant? The answer is, I am delighted um, to meet you. Okay, very good. So number one, hi, Andrew, how are you doing? What is your answer for that? Um, I'm very well, thank you. Okay, I'm very well, thank you. Let's check. May I introduce Mr. Tom Grant? I'm delighted to meet you. So that is the answer for the example. How about number one answer? Hi, Andrew. How are you doing? Fine, thanks. Okay, the answer is? Perfect. Fine, thanks. Okay, how about number two? Great to meet you, Camilla. Um, yes, the answer is great to meet you, Camilla. Okay, let's find out. It's okay. Great to meet you, Camilla. You too. Okay, the answer is? You too. You too. Okay, very good. How about, let's try to answer number three. I'm very pleased to meet you. Mm, I'm delighted to meet you. Too. Okay, very good. Let's try to check. I'm very pleased to meet you. I'm delighted to meet you too. Okay, you get the correct score. Um, answer. How about number four? This is my friend Annie. Okay, the Great answer is? You. Great to All meet right. you. Great to meet you. Very good. Let's Jatinda, check. this is my friend Amy. Great to meet you. Okay, very good. That's correct. How about number five? Good morning, Miss Boyd. How are you? Um, the answer is. Mm, 
you turn it to the top top of okay this one um from the top i feel i feel I'm, I'm very well thank you all right okay so let's check morning mr watt how are you i'm very well thank you okay very good i'm very well thank you how about number six this is um may i introduce miss whitewood um i'm i'm delighted to meet you okay very good let's try may i introduce mrs girdwood i'm very pleased to meet you okay so i'm very pleased to meet you all right how about this one but your answer is also correct okay so how about number seven this is shahid great to meet you okay very good all right perfect so this is for 1.10 activity good job next let's have another lesson okay it's all about countries. By the way, do you know what is countries? Yes. Okay. So we have different countries, right? So, and every country has or have different flags. Okay. So here is the first flag. What is this? It's Canada. Okay. So please read this one. Uses like Mexico, Cuba, Bolivia. Okay, very good. How about the second column? This one. Peru, Chile, Argentina. I don't know how to read this. And and the last one. Okay, this is Paraguay. 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 Okay, very good. How about this one? Uruguay, Brazil, Algeria, Algeria, Uganda. Okay, very good. So next, another flags. South Africa, Egypt, Sudan, Kenya. Portugal. Okay. Okay. It's Portugal. Very good. South Africa, Egypt, Sudan, Kenya, and Portugal. Okay. Very good. So another flags of the different countries. We have the last row. Please read. Spain, Republic of Ireland, Netherlands, France, United Kingdom. Okay, very good. So these are the different flags, okay, of the Philippines. I mean, of the different um countries. So how about this one? Okay. What are this? Okay, this is Germany, Italy. Slovakia, Slovakia, I mean Slovakia, Slovakia, French Republic, Poland. Okay, another. Greece, Romania, Turkey, Russia, Lebanon. Okay, very good. So another we have this one. South. Saudi Arabia, United Arab Emirates, Pakistan, India, Mon Mongolia. Okay, how about below? China, Helen, Singapore, Indonesia, Philippines. Okay, very good. So... I belong to this one, okay? I belong to the Philippines. How about below, another? South Korea, Vietnam, 
Japan, Australia, New Zealand. Okay, very good. So these are or those are the different flags of different countries. Okay, how about you? Where or which of these flags or which of these countries that you belong? Um, I come from Vietnam. Okay, you came from Vietnam, so you belong for this. Okay, but me, I belong to the Philippines. Okay, all right, Okay. so, okay, very good. So we're done for the different flags of the countries. So now let's have where things are. Okay, so by the way, but before that one, let's have first at the top. Let's try to read again some of these countries. Okay, let's try to clarify some words. Okay, so now can you please read this one again? Bolivia. Okay, very good. How about this one? Paraguay. Okay, it's Paraguay. How about this Para. one? Ch Okay, this is child. Child. Okay, very good. Another we have this one. This is or or Algeria. Okay, this is Algeria. Very good. How about this one? The first. Uruguay. Okay, Uruguay. 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 Okay, very good. Exactly. How about this one? Uganda. Okay, last one. Part Portugal. Okay, we have Uganda and Portugal. Okay, so do you understand all of this? Yes. Okay, perfect. So I think that's all for tonight. So let's continue this one for our next meeting, okay? So thank you for joining the class and see you again. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Bye-bye.